Okay. Hey, you would continue talking about uh, wanting to know if all the when all the girls in the class would go on their periods together. So what? somebody snapped back to him and said, "Jimmy, you're being an asshole. Don't talk to me like that." Wait, 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 wait. You just said something very profound. Like, why did he ask all the girls their periods? Because anytime a girl stood up to him, he said, it's just because you're on your period. Is that why you're being so bitchy right now? You're never like this right now. He would say that to Kate. He says that to, like, every girl. Yeah. He totally knows it's not my time. He's like, are you on your period? And I'm like, no. Oh, she's she's in a mood. She's definitely in a mood based on that comment. And I'm just going to make a recommendation never speak like that in the broadcast. Because that was a bad move. And I'm going to catch you shit for that for a very long time. I love you too. It's really wonderful. I really do love him. I'm sorry. I'm Tell so him the truth, though. but you don't, you don't do that. I'm sorry. That's okay. I would never do that to you. Six or seven years ago, would you ever involve yourself with these people? Absolutely not. I, and, and let me tell you that the one dude. Like, having sex with it, with every girl possible while he's married with children. And I'm sitting here thinking to myself, because I remember years ago, I was like, oh, there's no way. I, I And I'm judging him and whatnot. And he kind of brain, brainwashed me into this idea that that was the right way to be and that was okay. And that's when I started getting chauvinistic, right? And that's not who I am at all. Like, oh, man, guys, I lost my keys. I don't know if I can find these keys unless one of these ladies gives me a kiss on the cheek. Mm. or And one of these ladies does something... Uh, just like real cringy real outrageous shit so and that's when i started getting chauvinistic right hey katie can you stop in the middle of everything you're doing and come here to help me i'm very very monogamous as like i'm I'm, now different people have different desires and they want to do different things but me personally i'm monogamous i tell her i'm like katie you can do whatever you want but if you're with me you're only with me i can be with whoever i want but you're with me I can be with whoever I want. Because it's about the feelings. Exactly. Because Katie and every other hater needs to feel good. To pretend like their reality is okay. As a hater, this is okay. It's not. And you don't need my permission to let you know it's not. It's not okay. None of it. Uh, when you're one of the first three on the entire platform to get monetized and make a whole bunch of fucking money, and then also actually at the same time get verified as a gold star broadcaster within two months and reach over 10 million hearts in like three months, well, guess what? People were a little pissed because they're sitting at home, slapping their baby's bottom, wishing to God that they could get some sort of traction on social media. So there was a lot of middle-aged losers who are pissed off at a 23-year-old good-looking kid who came on, cared about his people, and built the platform in under six months. So fuck off. I won. Our people are awesome. Our community is the most positive community on Periscope, and you will never touch it. And you can try, and I hope you continue to try, because the competition and everything that you bring to the table gives me purpose. Every time you try to shut me down, all you do is drive me harder. I've been saying this since day one, and I hope you never quit. The whole virus, don't do it, keep going. I don't want you to stop. This is a real thing. I don't want you to stop. Because as soon as you stop, you remind me that I am no longer relevant. So long as you exist in my life, I am relevant. I'm a light. I shine light onto my people, onto my followers. You are the shadow behind that. The second the shadow goes away, guess what? That means I'm not shining a light. Don't go anywhere. I don't get why females won't take me. It's like, have sex with me. I'm a nice dog. That's all, folks.